We have a Windows 22 server which has a Veeam agent installed. Veeam agent has already done some backups and uh, so you can see there's, there's a job, there's the backups, store it on separate partition or disk, usually it's a separate volume. This is only a test environment so um, I'll show you how to use uh, the recovery media creation wizard to save uh, ISO. Make sure to include the hardware drivers from this computer. Save the ISO on the desktop. Below you can see the Veeam recovery, recovery partition is the F partition. Now all we need to do is the mount the ISO and copy all the files to the recovery partition and as you can see it's only 624 megs so the recovery partition doesn't have to be 10 gigs but I'd recommend to to have like 5, five to 10 gigs because there might be some drivers that need more space you know so this is uh, in my case I'm only using VMware workstation for the demo. Now launch the EasyBCD software and create a new entry. Uh, down there you go to the WinPI, WinPE and uh, name it. You put some name to recognize the name when the server will boot up you will see this uh, label as a second entry. And uh, uh, put the pass to the, as you can see on the screen, into the second entry. Then click the plus sign next to it and wait for the message. However, as VEZBCD needs to validate things, we need to change the, the time to count, countdown time to something else and then click save settings. Like this, it will register the pass correctly. Otherwise, the pass would be empty on the second one device if you don't change the time. So make sure you change the time so we overcome over this bug. Once you have this, this is it. You have a second entry as a, and uh, from there uh, you can reboot the server and boot from this uh, second entry in your bootloader. So let's reboot the server and check it out. And now instead of booting from a USB stick, which is slow, we can simply boot from the recovery partition uh, and we are booting our directly into our Veeam uh, recovery environment. So we are able to To launch the bare metal restore directly. It takes some time still, but it's much faster. Yeah, bare metal recovery. Here you go. It search for backup file, it found it, next, and you can choose the restore point you want. Thanks very much for watching, bye bye.